All right, let's do this. Let's do this. E3 thoughts on Sony press conference. Uh, me and my brother, shout outs to you, bro, Joe. We are talking on Facebook. They're actually showing uh, Days Gone right now gameplay. I don't really care much for it. I wasn't really fucking excited about the Sony press release. I'm sorry, I have to say it. I'm really bummed out. Showed a bunch of VR games about games that we don't really care about don't really care about they showed a resident evil vr without any zombies but it's a reboot it's not the resident evil we love we didn't see much the good part about the whole press release thing was one god of war finally a new god of war the intro was just amazing seeing Kratos running around with his son hunting for a deer and killing trolls and a bunch of stuff on the way there It was really epic. It started with that. I could give you that. That was cool No Last of Us 2. Some wannabe games right now playing like days gone right now. I'm, I'm, I'm They showed a Kojima game Kojima game with uh, Norman Reedus butt naked on a beach with a bunch of dead fish It was okay it was okay, but hey. Other best part was seeing Crash Bandicoot coming to Skylanders. I was really happy about that, having Crash Bandicoot coming back. Activision made a deal with Sony or something, and they have Crash Bandicoot back, and they will re-release 1, 2, and 3, remade, remastered on PS4. That is some awesome news. But in the wakes of all this, they showed a Naughty Dog Spider-Man game. I'm like, maybe Beanox gave it away and they made a deal with Naughty Dog. So Activision used to make Spider-Man, you know? We're gonna give you some, you give us some. So they took Crash Bandicoot and implemented him in the Skylander Imaginator game, which is cool. But I would like to see a whole new Crash Bandicoot game. From scratch that would have been epic seeing him in the game having an actual figure will be fun too of Crash Bandicoot for Skylanders but seeing Naughty Dog making the new Spider-Man game or movie whatever it's gonna be it's it looks like it's based on the movie it looks really epic so either that that game medieval game back in the days this girl hunting robots looked cool but all the rest of the VR games, I'm not planning on buying VR anymore, so kind of bummed out. I don't think it's going to catch on, but that's just my two cents. So, this is my thoughts on the press release. It's actually done. Oh, Dagon is looking good. This guy's just shooting a crowd of zombies coming out of, out of a train. It looked cool, man. But I don't know. Like I said, highlights was seeing the new God of War. Looked epic. I'm buying that. Oh, I got to add Tekken 7. Really looked cool. They put Akuma in it. I'm buying that. I'm buying that new God of War, that Tekken 7. Skylanders I will have for sure. But that's pretty much my hype of the whole evening. So guys, I hope you liked the press conference. What was your favorite highlight? What did you like the most? Probably Crash Bandicoot for all of us. Seeing him in Skylands. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So I love you guys. I'll see you soon.